Hey boys and girls, welcome to another super exciting, outrageous toy review. We're here at New York Toy Fair and we're going to check out the... Funko booth! Alright, let's go inside and take a look at all the new cool stuff they have to offer. So we have our Five Nights at Freddy's line. We're doing um, a bunch of different things for them. We've got our, our smaller plush, our jumbo plush. We have um, the My Mojis, I can talk about that in a second, with the plush and the vinyl. Um, we've got these new, really cool uh, ball joint action figures that we're doing kind of for the first time. A mystery mini set. We've got two different four packs of these smaller um, vinyl action figures. Key rings, bag clips, pens, water bottles. We're kind of just doing a whole bunch of different stuff um, that we don't typically do. So we're kind of really excited about this Five Nights partnership to do um, experiment with some different lines for them. Um, the MyMojis, we're kind of venturing into the digital space. So what these are, um, they come blind bagged and they're $2.99 and you get um, one of the vinyl figures, and then you get a code to download the emojis onto your phone. And we have that with some other licenses, too. Um, and our, all our Five Night stuff is uh, scheduled to hit stores in May. This is coming out in the Dorbs line this year, too. Um, you know, we started with Marvel and DC. Now you're going to see a bunch of new TV licenses. The Futurama's a newer one. Adventure Time we just announced. I think they are so cute. Um, Game of Thrones is a fun one. <laughs> Um, probably never seen them looking so happy. Bob's Burgers, yeah. And the Dorbs are fun too because we're um, kind of we're doing chases with a lot of them. Oh, there's Daredevil too. That's one of the newer ones. Like that Bloody Daryl down there is a chase variant. Um, the Gold Bender is a chase. I'm trying to think what else has chases here. Um, Hulk, there's a Red Hulk chase. Spidey, there's a Miles Morales suit chase too. And all our Dorbs chases are one in every six. So there should be a pretty good chance of finding them in stores, assuming that. Yeah, exactly. Where they don't actually yeah. exist. Yeah. So excited about that. It's I love the size of it. It's the same price as our other pop rides too. Um, so that's really cool. I think that's so fun that we did that. And the the Game of Thrones dragon pop ride too. I think it's so cool. So that's the whole that's the next wave of the Game of Thrones pops too. We just announced those in the last week, I think. Um, yeah, so we are so excited we can finally show off these Sailor Moon pops. We've been they, they got delayed a couple times, but we're finally, we finally have them. They look amazing. They look amazing. You know, some licenses are just meant to be yeah, pops, and I think course. this is one of them. So we're so excited. People are so excited. Sailor Moon looks incredible with a long... Uh, yeah, her hair, little. yeah. And I love I love when they come with their little a little friend yeah, <laughs> in the packaging. So that's I fun. I can't remember the cat's name. I can't either. I thought it was on the box. Luna, um, is that what it says? I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Um, Finding Dory is new for this spring, I guess, before the movie comes out. Uh, some of our newer video game lines down here also Doom, Uncharted, Call of Duty. So we've covered a bunch of the Fallout stuff. Yeah, Fallout's been pretty popular. And of course the new Pac-Man down here. Um, but yeah, no, we're excited about the Pac-Man line. I think we'll be able to do a lot of fun variants with those yeah, two. And, I yeah. about freaked out when I found yeah. out, so I'm really excited. <laughs> awesome. um, they're a lot of fun. They work um, so well with the pop style, you know. Yeah, and I love it. I love the ghosts floating on their stands and. Yeah, that was really good yeah. that they didn't just put the ghosts out, but they made them. Yeah, work. so that'll be a lot of fun. Now the different, my, the other new my emoji that are coming out: the Ghostbusters, My Little Pony, Ninja Turtles, Minions, and DC. And again, these are the same with that two ninety nine blind bag where you get one of the vinyls and then you get the code to download them onto your phone. I like like, the train. Yes, we just announced those. Um, we don't have Hermione's train car, but each of them come with an, come with their own train car, and they do oh. connect. So That'll that should be really a lot cool of fun. All of them. Yeah, that train is so cool. And then our new um, Supergirl, these three new Marvel ones: Doctor Strange, Spider Gwen, and Captain Marvel. I think they look so good. The new Ghostbusters pops too for the new movie. We had Paul Feig come by earlier, the director, yeah. and he came by and checked him out. And he's a big collector of Funko too, so, so that was kind of neat for him to come over. Playmobil, we just announced that lineup on Friday also. Um, oh, I knew the style looked familiar. Yep, okay, yep, so Playmobil, we, we funko fied the Playmobil figures, blew them up to six inches. Yeah. They are going to be sold individually, um, $14.99. And um, this is most of the first wave. I think we're doing Ghostbusters and I keep forgetting what the other one is. Supernatural, I believe. Too. It's part of the first wave. Kevin, so imagine the Playmobil saw it yeah. and started doing turtle sets. Yeah, that'd yeah. be incredible. Yeah. 
so these are a lot of fun. For me too, like I know we, I have known for a while that we were working on this line and I was like, oh, that's, you know, they're fun, they're cool. But then when I saw them in real life for yeah. the first time on Friday and I was like, okay, these yeah. are really cool. Yeah. <laughs> and they are articulated. Oh, so, cool. yeah. So they're fun. Yeah. It's a lot of fun. I'm also really excited about this, our new rock candy line, our five-inch stylized vinyl line. We're starting with DC and Barbie. Barbie, of course, is another big the announcement Barbie we made. Great. Yeah, I think these all look so cool. Um, we've got the two Batgirls, the two Wonder Womans, the classic in the movie, Supergirl, Harley Quinn. And the Barbies are kind of labeled by year that they came out. Okay. So, yeah, I saw um, the first Barbie. Yeah, yeah. so cool. Um, and the packaging, too, is is in the back there what they're going to look like a little more sassy than barbie usually does <laughs> yeah it's so sassy <laughs> and those are mystery minis too so the, okay. those, those, those barbies are going to be blind boxed and so those are so cute too yeah i think you're about to break into a whole new market with That's, just the barbie fan yeah i hope so as long as they like it we're in trouble if they don't <laughs> yeah yeah I, I don't see why they want to yeah do great yeah so Suicide Squad, we think is going to be huge. Yeah. yeah. Um, I, I think I huge. think everything in this line looks amazing. The Mopies, Mystery Minis, Dorbs, and Pops. Just the detail on them is incredible. They did they knocked it out of the park. This is Reese too, actually. The same guy who did Pac-Man did these. Oh, okay. So. <laughs> I like the Diablo thing. Yeah. The like I can't get over the the what they did with Croc. Yeah. yeah. That's the true. details are amazing. Yeah. And like Katana with their scar. It's just so cool. I think it's Harley Quinn Dorbs is just amazing. <laughs> so cute. Um, <laughs> but, yeah. Let's see. The new Alice in the Looking Glass. Mystery Minis and Pops, too. Um, Secret Life of Pets. I think these guys are super cute. Yeah, a lot of the booths we've been to have Secret Life of Pets yeah. stuff. Yeah, so that movie. I'm, I'm kind of excited about that movie, honestly. So. The initial trailer yeah. for it looks so funny. And Zootopia will have a mystery mini set too, I believe. Um, and the new Warcraft pops and dorms too for yeah, the movie. Yeah, get a picture of that for Ryan. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't know about this until I saw it here either. But there's a Chase Black Panther, so, oh. so that's fun. <laughs> And I, like, I think these dorms turned out so great. I love them. Those wings. Um, Vision's cape is, I think Vision's cape turned out really cool. That kind of translucent oh, wow. look, yeah. too. So. Mystery minis are super popular. Yeah. We had 16 different sets last year for mystery minis. We're going to double that this year. That Boba Fett. So. Look at that. Are the Super Shogun? That. Yeah, the Super Shogun. We have a few different variants of that, too. We also have him in the proto suit and his movie look. Awesome. Um, we have some of those for sale actually on funko-shop.com right now. Okay. Um, and yeah, that Kevin, group. I think you need that. Yeah. Those are <laughs> the super deluxe line is amazing. Yeah. And Hikari also, and we'll see some. We we did Disney. We just announced some Disney recently okay. with a Buzz Maleficent. There's a Jack Skellington too. Mickey. Oh, cool. Um, there's going to be some new DC and Star Wars this year also. Some new molds. I like all the colorful stuff. It really like the yeah. orange Mickey looks beautiful. Yeah, Mickey. Oh, and Stitch. Stitch has some of the coolest colorways I've seen us do so far. The oh new yeah. Stitch Hikari. So check those out for sure. Um, a new Walking Dead series, a new Game of Thrones series, and Warcraft. And the, the Arkham series is just hitting stores now, too. Awesome. Um, there's a couple, GameStop and Walgreens both have exclusive sets also. Oh, cool. Yeah. We still have some new, new legacy figures coming out, but I think we're kind of refocusing our action figure line. Okay. Um, and the reaction, too, we kind of pumped out like whatever we could the first year and a half or two years, yeah. however long it's been. We're kind of refocusing, kind of going to be more specific on what, what licenses okay. we choose to do. Keep keep the retro value there, you know? Yeah, it seemed know? like a lot of uh, the, like, weirder ones didn't do too well. Right. Like, kind of, I mean, like, like I always say Arrow and Flash, but those are the ones that I collected myself. But, you know, I don't think people are as into those as reaction as okay. they are, like, Karate Kid or Gremlins. Right, yeah. Or retro property. Right, exactly. So I think we're kind of retooling how we do pick the licenses for those. Um, I was really excited about I'm, Jaws. I'm, I'm freaking oh. out about that, though. 
Okay, this is really cool, I think. This turned out so awesome. It's going to be a two-pack. Obviously, she comes out of the, the loader. Um, we don't have pricing on that yet, but we, I'm sure we will soon. And then this is our brand new action figure line. Um, the reaction size at three and three quarters, but with more of the legacy sophistication, I guess. Okay. It's like more a of the higher. Two. Yep, and these are still going to be priced the same as reaction. Um, and then we have the wall playset also. We don't oh, have really? pricing on that either, but yeah, it's our That's first playset. We're so excited. No, nope, this is our first playset. We're very excited. Awesome. Yeah. Hopefully, that can lead to some more playsets too. So that'll be fun. I'd love to see a, a Nightmare Before Christmas playset. That would be really it's cool. Like the hill or yeah. something, or the town. That's a great idea. It's our new plush lines. Now we're up to three plush lines. This is our pop plush. I guess kind of four if you include the Mymoji plush. But um, this one's called pop plush. There's the regular six inch and the jumbo 12 inch. Uh, 9.99, 24.99 retail price. Uh, first wave, I believe, is hitting around June. And th this isn't our entire first. I think these might be two just two separate waves. I'm not exactly sure what what's coming out when. I just know the first ones are expected in June. I love that spider Gwen is one of the first ones. I was ones. just going to say that. That's awesome. This looks so great. That Loki looks so great, too. Um, you've probably seen our pop pens and our pop mugs. We're going to do, start doing some DC mugs, too, so that's exciting. Got some new Mopies and Fabrications, too. I think The Walking Dead and Ghostbusters Mopies made their debut here. I love that Smilers. Smiler. <laughs> Slimer is still smiling, is what I was trying to say. <laughs> Um, the new Alice Deadpool also, Futurama. Yep. <laughs> yep. That's really cool. Yeah, they're fun. And then some new fabrication down here too. Um, Flash and Daredevil I think we've announced, but they're here. Um, I think these four we hadn't announced yet. Kylo. Awesome. Phasma. That Stay Puft I think is like perfect. Yeah. He's awesome. <laughs> yeah, and Ant Man. So. That's, that's just about everything. Thanks for watching another super exciting, outrageous toy reveal. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, like, and check out all our other Toy Fair videos.